pleasant day for the horses at the farm there. And here's the caretaker. And it looks like he will ruin the day for them. He's going to transport loads till some destination. And he made four horses line up for it. They started going. The horses were able to go patiently until some distance. They have come across the slope and managed to climb half of the slope. The horses felt very exhausted climbing the remaining slope. They successfully arrived at the destination and got rid of the load. Never have I ever felt this exhausted. We need to get rid of this man. We have to escape him or we may die due to the workload. All the horses agreed to the saying of one horse and planned to escape the farm. They successfully got rid of the caretaker. He was shocked to see an empty farm. Oh, look at these unfaithful horses. They could not even take load. And they are so useless. I should get a few cows. They will blindly follow me and be so unproblematic. Let's quickly get them. Soon the caretaker brought a few cows to the farm. He now arranged a cart to transport the load again. The cows are perfectly dragging the cart until the slope comes. The cows started to feel exhausted trying to climb all up. But the cows somehow managed and succeeded to reach the destination. Then they got rid of the load. The cows are extremely exhausted and provided no water by the caretaker. This is absolutely cruel. We were close to death and we still managed to bring him the load here. That sick fella did not provide us water yet and he was hitting us back there. I think it's time to fix him now. Here the caretaker comes to trouble the cows again. And the cows will not tolerate him. They all surround him while swaying their horns. And the caretaker looks terrified. The cows began eating him to one another. This continued until he was finally thrown away. Lesson taught. There lives a happy young calf with his parent cows. He loves his mother the most. They share great love. One day the mother cow and the calf set out for grazing. They were happily munching some grass. And the trouble awaits. A tiger is up to a hunt. His target is none other than the young calf. Oh no! The 
The mother cow quickly came for the rescue. What? Listen to me, dear. Leave this place and go away quickly. The tiger tried attacking the calf again, but the mother cow sacrificed herself. The form of great love. What happened, son? A cunning tiger came and mom died what? rescuing me. The father cow quickly embraced the calf out of grief. The father cow comes to cheer up his son. Son, I know you love your mom so much, but don't punish your dad this way. The calf feels depressed by its mom's death and stays dull always. He always walks out of any conversation and comes and rests next to some lake and thinks of his mom. <coughs> Meanwhile, the father cow sees this from afar I'll make my son happy again by giving him a mother. Soon the father cow comes home with a female cow to introduce the stepmother to his son. Look son, she is your mother from now and she will take a great care of you. Don't be sad son. I may not be your actual mother, but I'll take care of you like you're my own so talk to me. There the calf leaves the conversation again and escapes to the jungle premises. There he goes again. I hope you will bring him back to a normal kid. You might be starving. Come on, let's eat food or you might grow weak. Listen to mama. Soon as the stepmother cow left the calf again escaped to the jungle. The stepmom returned and saw the calf was missing. What? And quickly set out to find him. While walking she is looking in every direction. She finally found him. Meanwhile, trouble arises. The tiger is up to attack again. What? The stepmother cow quickly ran and yeeted the tiger away. He is now coming to attack again. But the father cow came for the rescue again. He yeeted the tiger off and the tiger feared and left. Thanks for saving me mom and dad. I am really sorry to trouble you both. The calf has accepted the cow to be his mom and they united as a family again. He got embraced and they will be leading a normal life again.